Hey guys. Basically, I'm back here, and as you can see, I have got three of the six, can't make six fingers or whatever, uh, but I got three of the six uh, Balloon Circus uh, FNAF action figures, and obviously the ones I'm only missing are, you know, Circus Foxy, Balloon Freddy, and the exclusive uh, Balloon Foxy action figure, which that hasn't really been released yet, but yeah. Uh, but basically i went to fye uh mainly searching for the 13.5 inch freddy figure because i am very desperate and i need him uh but i was actually able to find these ones uh these guys instead and i'm actually glad i was because i actually have been searching for these or just been wondering when these guys are going to come out and uh, and well at least from where i went to they are out so yeah and i'm gonna be reviewing them one at a time and I'll make this go quickly, but actually before I do that, I'll just show one extra little thing real here real quick, and I got the Pocket Pop uh, Balloon Foxy as, you know, it was my first, you know, like video of reviewing the Circus Balloon Wave, I got the Balloon Freddy uh, Pocket Pop, and I haven't been able to find Foxy, but now I have, and here he is. I don't really think there's any need to open this guy since you can see him right here, and he's practically the same as the Pop like all pocket pops are so yeah there's not really ne any need to take this guy out so you can see him right there and yeah i mean he's cool and everything he changed the same nothing different but you can see he's here and got him but yeah that's all uh now i'm just gonna start all this off by reviewing our main boy uh freddy and here he is so uh interesting thing about this new wave is like with every fnaf wave we always have like uh separate little joints uh but for this one uh we actually have like like th like just one piece joints like most action figures how they work is like they're not separated like the fnaf ones where but here you know obviously you could see that they actually have you know there are they're one piece and uh you know, uh, there's not much else to explain about that. But also because, uh, you know, these are these are new kind of joints and everything. They also have a new way of, you know, popping off. And you can take these arms off. I'm not sure about the legs. Maybe the torso. But I don't know because there's that line. But I haven't been able to check. But I don't know. But the thing about these arms is like when you pop them off, it's harder to put them back on. <laughs> That's just always been like the, like the half, like like two minutes just trying to put this arm back on because it fell out when i was cutting the box open and like uh ev like how what like what i've been doing i've been keeping the box art since it's box art and you don't want to throw that way but yeah uh you know here is like circus uh freddy which obviously he is the more cuter version of fnaf which lots of og fnaf fans don't like for obvious reasons obviously since it kind of messes up the horror brand that fnaf did have uh but honestly i don't mind it because this is merchandise and you know it, like I, I respect for what funko's trying to do but then again i don't even know anymore uh i do like his little prop though as it's a as it's a you know it's a hammer but i like it's like the kind of like stuff hammer or whatever you want to call it i don't know the proper word or term but you know there's not much else to it you know he has the practical same design as the plush and pop and all that and yeah he just has a cute face or i guess more of a goofy one i suppose but yeah there's balloon freddy and now i mean there's balloon bonnie and here is the circus bonnie which just like the plush you know obviously has his all detail all of his details with the bells on the ears and this collar thing on his uh neck and uh at the end of his gloves as well and uh the, the most interesting he thing here though is like his prop at least to me as it's as it's obviously a carrot but it also looks like a piece of dynamite or something just judging by this like what i assume to be a spark but i have no idea uh you know some of these characters have very miscellaneous and confusing props and not necessarily a bad thing but it is hard to decipher but you can also see that you know he has his little 
red smile there, but it's, but it's, the thing about this one is like, it, like the smile here is very dark compared to like, like let's say his red nose and everything. Like it doesn't, it doesn't, you know, shine brighter like th like than everything else. Which on the plush, I'm pretty sure it did. Uh, but obviously I don't want the plush with me right now in my disposal, so can't really confirm or deny. But you know, he has his little buttons and his uh. Uh, bunny tail or you know yeah it's just a little tail right here which i guess i should also mention that freddy has one as well yeah not much to it uh but yeah i mean it's i mean it's bonnie and he didn't he didn't none of his limbs fell off when uh you know taking him out and didn't have to put him back together but yeah this is practically just circus bonnie i don't really have much to say about these two since i've covered like two variations of them and these aren't really that much that much different but one that is is this one and i'm sure right now and here is circus chica which this is uh at least the first that i've like first type of circus chica that i've reviewed on you know this channel as obviously there's another one and that's the mystery mini but i obviously i'm not going to do a review on the mystery minis as those are random and just who knows <laughs> but yeah, and like I said with Circus Bonnie on how these guys have distinct props and, and like, undefying ones, I guess. This is an example, as obviously right here, uh, you know, this is, like, this is in the shape of a fire extinguisher, at least from what I see. But it's filled with water, so it's like a water extinguisher or something. I don't really know the context of what these props are meant to be, uh, but it, it's fine, honestly. Like, it's not... Not that big of a deal. Also, I can't get this into your hand. Like, yeah, okay, just forget it. But yeah, like here's a figure, and her little skirt right here isn't like like just one solid piece where you can't move it. It's actually kind of like kind of like not rubbery, but like you know, it's like you could basically just like kind of squeeze it, and you know, it's it's not one still piece. Uh, you know, her limbs are obviously the same, and the thing about okay, something that you know uh, has been like like lots of mixed reactions have been made about like this this chica or at least i think but like or just kind of in chicas in general now where they all are just like white white colored and white skinned or whatever uh like you know and i do agree with people where i feel like you know it should have just been fun time chica and now we have fun time chica glamour chica and now circus chica with this you know white color uh but you know it, it it's fine honestly and also, she has more of a duck face, I feel like, just kind of looking at that. But she also has little ponytails, you know, that are colored with, you know, pink and all that. She also has a little party hat, which is strange, but, you know, whatever. And, like, and her, like, this one is very interesting, as her outfit, you know, it's cool. But when you look deep into it, you don't understand it. And, or at least I don't, but I don't know. But, yeah, that is practically it. Uh, for now, I uh, would like for reviewing the circus action figures and all right, hold on ah! So that is it for reviewing, you know, the like the first three action figures or at least the ones I could find uh, uh, But I also found out that circus foxy and balloon Freddy are actually available on Funko on the Funko's website You can actually, you know, order them and all that So who knows I might do that or whatever because honestly like when I <laughs> The FYE I went to to find these guys, uh, it's not in my city. I went out of town for it, all that. But, like, yeah, uh, you know, who knows? But that's all I really have to say. And I obviously will make videos on the rest of the figures when I get them. Or if I get them, probably. But, yeah, that's it for today's video. Not really else, not much else to say. And I know I'm on this kind of double, double like, daily upload streak right now. Even though it's just been, you know, the last, like, Life in a Nightmare episode in this one. But... Yeah, just, just just expect that I, i'm not gonna do this all the time but yeah anyways that is it for today's review not much else to talk about and goodbye